Learning out with Eric Flair show backstage at the second annual Dime Bash with all proceeds going to the Ronnie James Dio Stand Up and Shout Cancer Fund. And I'm here with Dave Drainman of Disturb. Dave, now we got here early. We saw you getting up on stage with Tom Morello, Vinny Apice, Geezer Butler, and there you are fronting that band, preparing to do Mob Rules live. And I, I swear, I saw you as a kid again. You were like in heaven. Tell me about that experience. Dude, afterwards, I was trembling. I hadn't, I hadn't been that nervous in, I don't know, 10 years, easy. I mean, these guys are all legends, and but especially to be able to play the song with, you know, Geezer, I mean, for the love of God, yeah. you know, Vinny, and Tom's a dear friend of mine, you know, and, and I've been looking forward to be able to jam with him again, and so it was just a tremendous honor, and I was like a kid in a candy store, dude. I, 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 I couldn't get that shit-eating grin off my face. It was unbelievable. It was, that's what life is about, that's the way it should be. Did you ever encounter or meet Dio? I did. I met him at the House of Blues in Chicago when I went to go see him play. Went backstage to meet him. Wanted to pick his brain a little bit. Then, hey man, I just wanted to know, um, you know, as somebody that really looks up to you, what do you do to warm up? What do you do to get ready for the show? And he puts his hand on my shoulder and looks me in the eye and he says, brother, if you have to warm up, you don't have it. I like that. So I shrunk to about six inches high and left the dressing room area. <laughs> That's my Ronnie James Dio story. And now what about Tom? I'm gonna prove him wrong tonight. Exactly. In his memory and for his glory, I'm going to prove him wrong. Well, well, you know what, Dave, uh, your pedigree speaks for itself. The success that Disturb has had uh, nobody can take that away from you. Thank you. So, so you're the man. Now, what about Dimebag? One of my dear friends, may he rest in peace. You know, on many an Ozfest together, spent time at his home. He's cooked for me. You know, we've judged bikini contests together. He actually even put it together one of his, you know, dime style videos of one of the dudes in Dallas that apparently does a really good impression of me. And he kind of did. He had me pretty spot on. It was just hysterical. I mean, we, we had a tremendous respect and admiration for each other and a deep love, you know, for everything that that is metal. And, and, and he was just the sweetest, most kind-hearted individual, you know, just his modus operandi, as I've said many times, always making sure that you were having the best time possible. Very selfless. You know what? It's, it's, I knew Dio very well, and he always treated me like a son, and I, I just met Dimebag for an instant on a tour bus one time, but it's, it's odd to me how these great people, that people, uh, that individuals have such great things to say about were taken so quickly. Yeah. It's a tremendous loss, and we still feel it. Yeah. And I think we always will. What's going on with Disturb? Indefinite hiatus. This means we don't know when we're coming back. Really? Mm -hmm. what, 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 what do you think it is for you? It's just time, man. It's just time. You know, we've been going for 12 years straight. Make a record tour, make a record tour. It's just time to step, step away for a while. What do you, what, what, now what is in your heart? What do you want to do next? Have a baby. Really? Mm -hmm. I'm married. I want to make a baby. I want to have you know, a home and a family and you know, just like the rest of my bandmates. Yeah. It's my turn. That's awesome. Yeah. Well, wow, that's great, man. Okay, so you won't be working on any musical solo projects? There are no plans for that, no. Well, Dave, it's been great having you on the show. Thank you so much Thank for you. your patience and your time. No problem. Blaring out with Eric Blair with Dave Drainman of Disturbed signing off. The Blaring Out Show.